here, Senior Gold Ambassador with Plexus Worldwide, and welcome to the fourth and final video in my Jumpstart on January series. Today is all about goal setting, and it's the perfect time of year to talk about that because you're setting goals anyway for the new year. You know you are, so why not set some goals uh, as it refers to your Plexus business? And it's important that I know as your sponsor, what it is you want to accomplish. Are you just um, a Plexus ambassador to get the discount, which is perfectly fine, that's a very wise choice, um, just for price alone? Are you wanting to get your products paid for maybe? Um, maybe make an extra few hundred a month? Or do you really wanna go all the way with this um, and be driving a Lexus one day and going to Hawaii, like I do? Um, all of those are what I consider long-term goals, which are fabulous, and you do need to know what those are. But long-term goals without daily activity are just long-term wishes. So today, I wanna focus on your short-term daily goals. There's five of them five things I want you to do every single day. And it's up to you how much or how little of each of these activities that you do based on what your goals are. Someone that wants to be Emerald will have to do more of these things. Someone that just wants to get their products paid for will do less, but you should be doing them every day. Here's the first one. Okay, the number one goal I want you to set is how many times a week are you going to post on Facebook about Plexus? I want you to decide that number, write it down, write the days down, and then be intentional about it. Don't just be all willy-nilly because you, um, you need to be hitting the three different markets, the people that wanna lose weight, the people that wanna get well, and the people that wanna make some money. All three of those areas need to be hit. Now, last year, I only posted once a week about Plexus. That's all I was comfortable with. This year, I'm going to up it to two. Why? Because I want to hit Emerald by July, and so I'm going to need to increase my Facebook activity, I think, to do that. Now, not everybody's going to comment all the time. Some of my posts will look like nobody's read them. That's okay. You still need to be consistent. Why? So that when people are ready, you have let them know by consistently posting that you are still doing this and that they um, can come to you when they are ready. So decide how many times a week, write it down. Number two, how many people a day do you think you need to talk to about Plexus to reach your goal? Okay, last year my goal was I talked to one person a day. If it happened naturally, great, I was done. If it didn't happen naturally when I was out and about, then I would get a little more proactive and maybe message someone who had commented on my post or reach out to someone entirely new. This year, however, because my goal is a little bigger, my number is going to have to get a little bigger too. So I am going to reach out to three people a day about Plexus. And I am going to actually write down on my calendar who those three people are each and every day so that I make sure that I'm organized and ready to go. So come up with a number of people that you feel you want to talk to or can talk to each day and then hold yourself accountable to hit that number. Number three, customer ambassador relations. You need to be checking in with your customers and ambassadors on a regular basis. You can't just sign them up and then leave them high and dry. Why? Because you need to find out how are they feeling? How are they doing? Are they being consistent? Are they drinking their water? Um, maybe they're about to quit and you would not know that if you didn't reach out to them. So if you have a small team, obviously you don't wanna reach out to them every single day. That's irritating. But make sure you're putting on your calendar who you need to be reaching out to on a daily basis. Um, for me, because I have a little bit of a bigger team, I'm going to be reaching out to one customer and one ambassador every single day to make sure they're doing okay. Sometimes that's going to happen naturally, by the way, and then I've achieved my goal. 
but sometimes it won't. And so I will need to be a little bit more proactive about that. So how many customers and how many ambassadors are you going to reach out to each and every day in 2017? Write it down. Number quattro, your friends list, both the list of people that you have that you're going to reach out to about Plexus and your Facebook friends list. You need to be expanding both of those each and every day. If your goals aren't very big, then maybe you will need to add one person a day. But for me, I'm gonna add two to three people a day to both my Frank's list and my Facebook list to keep my network growing so I don't run out of people to talk to, okay? So come up with that number, write it down, and then make it happen. And finally, personal growth. Come up with the amount of time you're going to spend at least every day on personal growth, whether it's learning more about the company um, learning more about the products, learning more about how to share these products with other people by reading books on network marketing, um, you decide. And here's a few ideas of easy ways to do that. Um, I've added myself to some of the larger team pages from some of the diamonds in the company so that I can learn from them. They always post a lot of great videos. So here are the names of the team pages that you could add yourself to to be able to have access to those great resources. The other thing you can do is watch YouTube videos um, from some of the uh, higher level ambassadors in the company. I drove all the way to Delaware this summer and listened to YouTube videos the entire way there and the entire way back. That's a heck of a lot of YouTube videos. And here are the names of some of the people that I found extra inspiring. Finally, it's always a great idea to be reading um, books about network marketing um, and personal growth. And here are a list of some of the books that I recently read that I loved. So decide how many minutes a day you're gonna spend on each of these five things. Facebook posting, checking in with your customers, how many people are you gonna reach out to, how many people are you gonna to add to your lists each day, and how much time you're gonna spend on personal growth. And if you do that each and every day, then your long-term goals will become a long-term reality. But you can't do that unless you do a little something each and every day. Have a great 2017.